having Zoe in class is fantastic. She's one of those students who really embodies pretty much anything that you would want in a student. An incredibly hard worker, extremely creative, out of the box thinking, her skill level is through the roof, and just a sweet kid as well. Specifically with my paintings of ears, they're ear landscapes, and I like to put something weird in them that it's kind of unique to the ear. Like in some paintings, I have earwax in them, real earwax. And I think that, that people don't see that at first when they go up to it, but then when they get closer, they see the earwax and they're completely disgusted by a painting that would normally look really beautiful. It's kind of intentional. Not, not all the paintings have earwax in them, but my favorites have earwax in them. really kind of like the painting on the left there at the moment. I recently made it and Mr. Loftus said that it has to be like his favorite piece of work he's ever seen ever of, like from any of his students and that really kind of got to me since he's had so many students. Her work is so different in so many ways, in particular as a painter. Uh, I would say in my 20 years of teaching she probably is, if not the best, one of the very best painting students that I've ever had a pleasure to teach. Mainly with the works I've made recently, the meaning of the works would have to be that I want to be, I want to like bring happiness to the viewer.